welcome. This is a LabVIEW project for an Oregon Institute of Technology Engineering Programming course, uh, 267, instructed by Dr. Matteo Aboy. This is Steve Levich. Um, what we have here is a signal generator and oscilloscope. First, let's take a look at the signal generator. Um, all of the controls are at the bottom of this form factor below this gray bar here. Uh, this is where we can control the wave type, sine, DC, triangle, sawtooth, square wave. We can adjust the duty cycle. We can adjust our frequency down here. The, um, the amplitude we can adjust here. Uh, of course, the offset we can adjust. We also have the ability to add noise to our signal, uh, both Gaussian and uniform noise. We have indicators showing what the signal generator is generating. Above here, this gray bar, we have all of the oscilloscope and spectral analysis um, being done here. Off to the left side in this section, uh, we can adjust the uh, millisecond uh, division at this point. Uh, we can also adjust the volts per division here. Uh, we can add filters um, for the signal that's coming into the oscilloscope smoothing, band stop, band pass, high pass, and low pass. We also can adjust the upper and lower cutoff for the filters. Up above here, we have the ability to um, write the data to a file. We can trigger our screen. We can write that screen to a file if we would like. Um, we also have the ability to uh, do measurements manually here with the cursors. We can also take a look at the DAQ input here. This is where we're getting a signal from um, the DAQ. Right now I'm just holding one of the wires because I don't have a, a signal generator, but what you can see is I'm simulating a signal and it's generating um, about a 60 hertz signal. So, But if we had an external signal generator, you would see it at this point. On the spectral analysis portion, we have the ability to adjust our maximum frequency, write the image to a file, change our window type to low sidebar, seven term, many, many different options here, and adjust it from DV or linear. Um, the right side of the screen on the oscilloscope is showing you the uh, frequencies coming in, amplitude, maximum and minimum volts, peak to peak. Um, and the mean, uh, we can also change our plot width on the bottom here. Um, I think that about covers it. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed the demonstration. Come back soon and look for more OIT engineering projects on YouTube.